Hey everyone, this is Andrew Tai. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to pair Joy-Cons to macOS Ventura and get it working with Ryujinx. So if you didn't already know, Ryujinx is a Nintendo Switch emulator that works great on Apple Silicon Macs. If you want to find out how to install that, then please make sure to follow the link in the description. Today I'm going to show you how to fix a specific issue with getting the left Joy-Con working with Ryujinx and Switch games. So hopefully this is going to fix your problem if you experience it too. So no, if you haven't subscribed already, then please consider subscribing and you'll be able to keep up to date with the latest Mac gaming tutorials. Now, a lot of people notice that if you try to pair Joy-Cons, the left Joy-Con is not working correctly. It does not map properly to Ryujinx. But there is a fix, which I'm going to show you how to do now. So in order to pair up our Joy-Con controllers, the first thing that we need to do is to go to the top left hand side of the screen, click on the Apple logo and then go to system settings. Then we're going to go to Bluetooth section here and we're going to make sure that we have Bluetooth turned on and that we have nearby devices searching. And then we need to put our Joy-Cons into pairing mode. So if you get your Joy-Con here and you press this little button here and basically you want to kind of hold this down until it starts flashing like that and that's going to make it appear under the nearby devices list we're going to go ahead and press the connect button and basically once it's paired then this light should be solid so the left Joy-Con here is paired up we're going to do the same with the right Joy-Con hold it down until it starts flashing then press the connect button under nearby devices and now that is paired up. So the main problem is that you're going to notice that this is not going to pair up correctly with Ryujinx. So in order to do this, what we need to do is to install Steam and then add Ryujinx as a Steam application. So I'm going to double click on our Steam application, which I've already installed. So once we have Steam opened up, we're going to click on games on the menu bar and then click add a non-Steam game to my library. Here we're going to allow access. And then we're going to click the browse button. So we're going to select Ryujinx here, press open and make sure that's ticked on the left and then click add selected programs. And now if we do a search for Ryujinx, we're going to launch this through Steam. So I'm going to press the play button now. Now Ryujinx is going to open up and we're going to go to options and then settings. And then we're going to go to input and then we're going to select the input device, Nintendo Switch Joy-Con L and R. So we want to select this one as a combined controller. So select this and then we're going to make it emulate a Joy-Con pair like that. Now we're going to press save and now we're going to launch a game. Here we're going to open up Metroid Prime. So we have the little Steam overlay icon there. That means that the Joy-Cons are going to go through the Steam input. So now you can see that both Joy-Cons are working correctly. I can hold down this left shoulder button and then this Joy-Con joystick is working correctly. I can fire and this is basically working 100% correctly. So that is how you work around the Joy-Con issue with Ryujinx 1.1.0 on macOS.